other day I woke up before everyone else. Yannick was sleeping in the room next door, which was perfect for my plan, because I had a big surprise planned for him. And let me just say, I was in a very good mood. We used to hang around town pretty late. I spent the week thinking about her next day. It was easier than, so much easier than. Yeah, we had one of those things. I was in such a good mood that I was probably a bit overhyped. It was probably good that Janet wasn't there for this. Guys, I'm pumped. I'm ready to tackle the day. And I'm about to wake Janet up because I'm gonna surprise him today and he has no idea what's about to happen. Babe, get ready. For what? I have something planned. Me too. I'm sleeping longer. <laughs> Get ready so we can go downstairs, okay? <laughs> okay, we're here and I wanted to ask you, do you know what we're doing today? No. I want us to tell them about our first date. When was that? Right? In LA? Well, I feel like we didn't have a first date. No, not really, I guess. But well, I would have said LA. Yeah, why? Because although we weren't a couple yet. You didn't even know I like you. <laughs> yeah. You always say you didn't you know. You like me as a friend. He changes his mind we were all the friends. time. It was a friend date. A friendly date. Yeah. <laughs> Explain what happened on our first friend date. <laughs> we wanted to meet for breakfast at IHOP in Los Angeles. Yeah. I was there on time and then half an hour later, just comes around the corner. 20 dum, minutes. Dee -dum, dee -dum. What's up, y'all? <laughs> 20 minutes. I don't know, it was the very first time that we were gonna hang out alone. And I was excited because I found him super hot. <laughs> when I saw him, my heart stopped. Because I was like, oh my god, he's so handsome. But I also felt like, oh shit, I'm 20 minutes late. <laughs> well, anyways, shortly after we got our food, she left me there <laughs> because she was meeting another guy, so. I was meeting another German guy. <laughs> so that could have been our first date. Otherwise it would be when you went to Germany. Mm -hmm. On the first day I was teaching a dance class in Berlin. We were in the dance studio and afterwards we went to the Reichstag where there's a big garden in front of it. We sat down in the grass mm -hmm. and we were just talking and chilling, being all giggly and like... Uh... Chemistry. And then afterwards we went to a restaurant and it's my favorite one. No. It's one of my favorite restaurants in Germany. It and was pretty nice, I would say. Yeah, I thought it was super nice too, but I was freaking out because I was super sweaty. So I was very weirded out. <laughs> what is that thing doing there? The people looked super fancy in the restaurant and I was literally wearing super baggy pants. So I thought I really don't fit in in this restaurant and I cannot believe this is the first time we're going out and I'm just wearing this. Because it was unplanned and sometimes the things that you don't plan are the best ones. Yeah, it was like, no makeup. Beautiful. <laughs> Gracias. So that was our first date. It was very spontaneous and it wasn't planned at all. So um, that was it. Thank you for your, like, you can go now. Okay, <laughs> cheers. So there you go, guys. That was our first date. And for us, it was pretty spontaneous. We didn't even know what we were doing. That doesn't mean that it wasn't magical and romantic because when I think back of that day, I remember it with so much love and I think it was one of the happiest days of my life. Now, here's the thing. We've been together for almost six years now and this Wednesday is our monthsary. And I realized I really want to give Yannick something very special because I know he has been missing his family and I also just want to give him his epic movie date that he deserves. So I have something special planned for today. Ok, 
Okay, so I found this small business here in my city that is absolutely beautiful. I think it's gonna be perfect for this surprise because they build a home cinema in your own backyard. They make it look amazing. They even bring a huge screen and the projector and everything. So I'm very excited because we love the cinema. We even have like the super fun membership card. So I think Yannick is really gonna appreciate this for our first date. Hopefully he likes it. And I'm gonna make nachos because I want nachos. <laughs> Yeah, there's no other reason for that one. I was very concerned because it has been raining in San Luis Potosí the last weeks, but today is super sunny. It looks like the weather is gonna be amazing. So fingers crossed everything goes according to plan. They're gonna come to set everything up at 7 p.m. So I'm just getting ready already. Uh, wish me luck. Okay guys, it's almost 8 p.m. and the surprise is ready. I can't believe it, I think Yannick is gonna freak out. It's super cool. I asked Yannick to stay in his room for 40 minutes with noise canceling headphones so he has no idea what happened because they were making some noise. And I'm gonna wait a little bit more until the sun is a little bit lower. In the meantime, I distracted him with some food. Hello. Hello. Wow, your room is a mess. I have my first surprise here. Close your eyes. Open your eyes. Ice cream. Yes, I knew it. <laughs> Ice cream and one for me. Hey. Oh. <laughs> and shortly after, it was time. Okay guys, I'm here with Yannick. I'm about to reveal the surprise to him. I'm super excited. I Ew. hope he likes it. Go a step forward. There's nothing, there's nothing, there's nothing. Trust me, trust me, there's nothing. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> okay, stop. Okay. One, two, three. Wow. Okay, that's a surprise, y'all. We're gonna watch movies wow. tonight. Wow. <laughs> So I really wanted you to have the epic movie first date that you deserve uh -huh. because our first dates were very spontaneous <laughs> so I hope you like it Yes, I love it I brought wine <laughs> Nice So we can get drunk in it <laughs> Can you open it? Oh my uh, god, oh my god No problemo This wine has gold and it's not that expensive, <laughs> but it makes me feel fancy. Okay, wow, look at that goal. Can you see it? Wow, coming up. The day that we're posting this video is our monthsary. Oh, makes sense now. I also thought that a cinema at home and under the stars mm -hmm. was a good idea because we love going to the cinema together mm -hmm. and we haven't been to the cinema in three months. That's true. Or probably more. <laughs> and you can choose the movie. Star Wars. <laughs> I already thought so. I thought so already. No, not Star Wars. We're gonna find something that we both like. Okay. Upstairs, when I was locked inside of my room, I only heard like, dum, dum, yeah. dum. But I still had no idea that it would be a home cinema. <laughs> I'm so happy that you like it. Yeah, I'm excited. To you, to this lovely surprise. You're welcome. Her birthday is soon. And now, I have to come up with something <laughs> even better. Thank you. What am I supposed to do now? <laughs> my voice. <laughs> Auf uns. Auf uns und dich. We're gonna poop gold. Yeah, actually we will. <laughs> <laughs> By the way guys, I have the nachos. Wow. They don't have anything because I was lazy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But we can add some jalapenos. We can, love jalapenos. Yeah, jalapenos and frijoles. Oh, do you know? Frijoles. Yeah, nachos have frijoles, jalapenos and cheese. Not in my country. <laughs> we had a beautiful night under the stars. And I got a little bit drunk. Even though this wasn't our first date, it sure was a good one. <laughs> Happy Monterey, Danny.